Yo, what is up? So, I've actually decided to put the 7900 XTX back in, take it out for a spin, because I want to try out some games with the FSR4 DOL. And as you can see there, we advanced together. Well, that's not totally true, because uh, maybe if you're, maybe if you've got a Narden A4 card, but if you if you got a Narden A3 card, um, you are not, you're literally being left in the mud. So that's got to change for me. So it's not going to be, don't get me wrong, it's not going to be a hate video at all. It's just me, if I just had the 7900 XTX, I didn't buy the 97 XT. I definitely would be a bit pissed off, if I'm being honest. So, because this is still a great card, and I believe it deserves, it definitely deserves FSR 4 in some way, like a lighter version for Arden A3 would be great. So as uh, as other people have said, I don't think it's right. Um Ancient Gameplay's done a video on it and he was he was totally right. Um I mean if if it's capable of doing it it should be supported. I mean So this is a Callisto protocol. I've actually got to the DLC now but yeah as you can see so I've, I've used the Optus Scale and then I've just put the Arden A3 DOL over it, that, or the Int 8 call, so I can use FSR 4. It's 4.0.2. So it's, all that's not as good as the Arden A4 version. Like There's, there's going to be more flicker and stuff like that, but it's definitely better than FSR 3. I mean, I, I still really like the 7900 XTX. Um, so, I had a great time with it, and I'm not going to sell it. I don't sell graphics cards uh, of value, so I'm definitely... I'm never going to sell this. No way. Uh, it's really, if I'm being fair, um, if I'm comparing it to the 9070 XT, there's going to be games where the XTX will be better in, but then there's going to be other games where there's ray tracing baked in. Obviously, I mean, as I've said in the past... Um, when you turn FSR 4 on, there is an advantage with a 97 XT. But it depends on the game with uh, the advantage a lot of the time. So there's still quite a few games where the XTX is quite a bit better in. And uh, obviously you've got the VRAM advantage. So, But then the 97 XT is literally such great value for the performance. And uh, that's why I called it, I said in the past, actually when I was talking about these two graphics cards... Is a it is almost a flagship to the point of where you wouldn't really care. I mean, for me personally, if I'm getting FSR four better image quality, I'd probably uh, take the five FPS loss or whatever it's losing to the XCX buyer. But then I still value the XCX, and uh, and there's definitely other games where it wins by about fifteen or twenty FPS. So again, it literally depends on the game, but. I value both cards. I love the 92 XT and this card. I mean, so I want it to be supported. This, so I mean, even with recording, I'd say so. I've got the FSR4 int 8 file installed on this game. Now I think the XTX is actually beating the 92 XT in this. Uh, oh, that's not a massive difference. So it's obviously more than capable of running FSR4, and it kind of reminds me of the. I mean the where NVIDIA actually locked out the 3000 series from the frame generation even though they can run it. So they actually use a mod as well. And it looks like until AMD, I don't know if they're going to do it or not, but it looks like you can have to use OptiScaler, which is better than nothing. I mean, at least you can get it like I'm doing this game. So I've put the XCX back in because I want to check out a few more games, seeing the differences. So I'm going to look at Outer Worlds 2. I'm, I'm interested to see how uh, World X X is doing in that. So I'm going to have a good look. I might even keep it in for a month and just have a play around with it. I feel like trying something different. And then hopefully by the time I put the 97 XT back in, there's going to be more, like literally more games with the machine learning frame generation to test. So I, th I thought that would be the plan. And there's quite a few games I'm currently playing, which I think the XCX is going to be fine in anyway, so that's what I thought. But I would hope um, they do do it eventually. I mean, they separated the two branches, like Arden A1 and 2, and then they put Arden A3 with a uh, 4. So, 
You'd hope they would do it. I mean, it is totally crazy if they don't, in my opinion. And I think, I think they deserve people getting the ump. So, so yeah. I mean, I'm happy with Arden A4, but I'm just thinking if I didn't get the 90 cent XT, I would be quite annoyed. So, anyway, that's it for me. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.